Hello, welcome to Zebra Trade. My name is Ashwini. In this video, let's go through the Zebu Nest Trader interface. To do that, let's first install the application. Please visit the zeboetrade.com website and under apps, you will find the option download. You will now find the two variants of the same software, the 32-bit and the 64-bit. As per your system specifications, please download the appropriate software. My system demands me to install the 64-bit and hence I'm clicking on that to install. Go to your download section and click, and click on this folder. Allow the program to open and you will find the setup wizard. Click next. So for best experience, we recommend you to create a folder on your program files and install the software on that folder. Let me show you how. Go to your local C drive. Under program files, right click and create a new folder. Let me call it the Zebu Nest Trader platform. So once you have created this, close the tab and here in the setup wizard back, click on browse and choose the Zebu Nest Trader platform. Click OK. Again next, next and finally install. So once the tool is launched, please put in your username, click on go, put in your login password. Once you're done, click on login. For the first time users, you will receive your transaction password on your registered email ID. Please put in the password and change it accordingly. In my case, I have already changed it. Now, please answer the security questions that you have been prompted to and click on go. So this is your interface once you have logged in. Click OK. So for the first time users, your screen would typically be blank. Just like this. Let's add few scripts here. So I have added according to my requirements. You can change it accordingly. Now, you will have to keep in mind some keyboard shortcuts for optimal experience. For example, you can press F1 to buy, F2 for selling, F3 to find out the pending and executed orders. In order to understand the market depth, press F6. To find out the trade book, press F8. So this is where your day's trade is shown. Press F11 to find out the net positions. Since I don't have any, the screen is blank. And finally, in order to know your cash balance, click on view order or trade reports. Under that, choose view RMS limits. In this option here, click show all clients and once you do this, you will find the cash margin here. So I hope this video was useful to you. See you on the next one.